Transport in Ivory Coast Ivory Coast invested remarkably in its transport system. Transport infrastructures are much more developed than they are other West African countries despite a crisis that restrained their maintenance and development. Since its independence in 1960, Ivory Coast put an emphasis on increasing and modernizing the transport network for human as well as for goods. Major infrastructures of diverse nature were built including railways, roads, waterways, and airports. In spite of the crisis, neighbor countries, Burkina Faso, Mali, Niger, and Guinea, still strongly depend on the Ivorian transport network for importing, exporting, and transiting their immigrants to Ivory Coast. The nation's railway system is part of a 1 plus 260 kilometer long route that links the country to Burkina Faso and Niger. 1 plus 156 kilometer of railroad links Abidjan to Ouagadougou, capital of Burkina Faso. Built during colonial era by the firm Abidjan Niger, RAN, this railroad freed several landlocked countries among which were ex high Volta Burkina Faso, Niger, and Mali. This railroad, operated by Sitarail, plays a key role as regards to the carriage of the goods, livestock, and the transport of people between Ivory Coast and border countries, 1 million tons of goods have transited in 2006. In 2005, despite the negative impact the crisis had on the sector, benefits engendered by transporting the goods and people via RAN, are estimated respectively at 16309 at 3837 billion chefe. As of 2004, the railway network consisted of a state-controlled 660-kilometer section of a 1,146-kilometers narrow-gauge railroad that ran north from Abidjan through Buak and Furkasadugu to Ouagadougou, Burkina Faso. Ivory Coast Road Network spreads over 85 plus 000 kilometer consisting of 75 unpaved, 65 plus 000 kilometer, and 224 kilometers highways. It provides national and international traffic with neighbor countries. The Trans-West African Coastal Highway provides a paved link to Ghana, Togo, Benin, and Nigeria, with paved highways to landlocked Mali and Burkina Faso feeding into the coastal highway. When construction of roads and bridges in Liberia and Sierra Leone is complete, the highway will link to another seven economic community of West African states, ECOWAS, nations to the west and northwest. At the national level, Vehicles are estimated at 600,000, which includes 75% of used cars, secondhand, due to the low purchasing power since the beginning of the economic crisis. 20,000 new cars are registered every year. Although maintenance and renovations works are being carried out since middle 2011, over 80% of the Ivorian network is older than 20 years and therefore damaged. In addition, a significant traffic exists throughout Abidjan, the capital. This traffic is mainly composed of taxi, buses and minibuses locally referred to as Kabaka. The country counts with two four-lane motorways, the first one running from Abidjan to Yamasukro for a length of 224 kilometers, and the second joining Abidjan to Grand Bassam, with a length of 30 kilometers. Both are built with modern technologies and under international standards of security. Landscape View of the Autonomous Port of Abidjan Ivory Coast greatly contributed to developing maritime transport by building two ports on its seaside namely, Autonomous Port of Abidjan, sometimes referred to as Lung of Ivorian Economy, and the San Pedro Port. The total traffic in 2005, by adding importation to exportation, was 18,661 784 tons for Autonomous Port of Abidjan and 1,001,991 tons for San Pedro. Harbor activity is concentrated at Abidjan, West Africa's largest container port, which has facilities that include a fishing port and equipment for handling containers. The autonomous port of Abidjan covers a 770 hectares area and shelters 60% of the country industries. It is the first tuna fishing port in Africa. It contains 36 conventional berths spread over 6 kilometers of keys providing a capacity of 60 commercial ships with multiple special docks a container terminal as well as several specialized and industrial berths. The other major port, the San Pedro port, operates since 1971 and has two keys covering 18,727 meters area. Apart from those two major ports, there are also small ports at Sassandra, Abasso, and Dabu. Ivory Coast has three international airports located in Abidjan, Yamasukro, and Boaki. Fourteen smaller cities also possess regional airports, the most important of which are Daloa, Corhogo, Man, Odian at San Pedro. 
27 aerodromes exist and are operated by a public establishment, the ANAM, National Agency for Civil Aviation and Meteorology, except the activities carried out by the ASECNA, Agency for Security of Air Fred in Africa and Madagascar. Since the outbreak of the crisis, only five of these airports are available. These are Abidjan, San Pedro, Yamasukro, Daloa, and Tubadot. Regarding the International Airport of Abidjan, official statistics from 2005 showed 14,257 commercial movements, departures, and arrivals, 745 180 commercial passengers, arrivals, departures, and transit, and 12,552 tons of commercial freight. The airport of Abidjan covers 90% of the air traffic of Côte d'Ivoire and generate 95% of the overall profits of the sector. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.